Well, college football is back, but are Lobo fans excited enough about the season to pack the stands? Action 7 News reporter Brandon Evans was at today's game for the Lobo's big win. With the hope of improving the fan experience, <laughs> Lobo's games have a new tailgating zone, complete with live music, food, drinks, and games. Optimism about the season was high. A winning season is what I'm our goal is, at least my goal. And so was the temperature. It's been pretty, pretty darn hot. Yeah. I think it's like 100 degrees. But the band played on. We're Lobos too, so woof, woof, woof. Many hoping it was the brutal heat and not the team's play that is leaving thousands of seats empty. You know, I remember coming to the game when I was younger and this, you know, the stadium was full and people loved it. And now. <laughs> One thing everyone agreed on, winning fixes everything. Hopefully we start winning, they'll go up, you know, it's all about winning. All it takes is a win. Exactly, a few wins and I think the stadium's going to fill up. And with season ticket sales also down a couple of thousand for a third straight year. Y'all enjoy the game. That may be just what the Lobos have to do. Brennan Evans, KOAT Action 7 News. Well, some scary moments after the game for Lobos head coach Bob Davey. We're told he was rushed to the hospital after suffering chest pains. UNM Athletic Director Eddie Nunez said Davey suffered what appeared to be a serious medical incident. We'll, of course, have an update as soon as we learn more. Well, now let's take a look at some of the big plays from today's game. Well, running back today, running back Tony Collier had a big day, more than 100 yards and two touchdowns. This one, a long run to the end zone and the second plowing in from a couple of yards out. Despite being injured and not finishing the game, quarterback Brand Hughes was on point in the first half. His receivers making some big grabs today and the defense coming up big when they needed it. The Lobos winning 39 to 31.